Hi guys, it's Lita. So, um, when I was 15 on my old channel, I made a video that was kind of like an about me video that just said like facts about me. I decided to do another video kind of like that, but this time it's going to be a little bit more in depth or a lot more in depth. I've been thinking a lot about things that I'd like to change about myself, so I decided to make an about me video focusing only on the flaws that I have because I think that flaws aren't something to be ashamed of, but more so something that you can learn from. This is kind of just a list of the flaws that I've found in myself that I haven't looked at before, but now I'm kind of starting to look at. I tend to think that I know a lot more about situations than I actually do. And I actually have a whole lot to learn about everything. I can be very, very blind to things. I also tend to deny what's actually going on. I keep things to myself most of the time. Even if it should be said, I don't. I personally don't think that's a huge flaw, but a lot of other people have been upset with me about it. So I am extremely afraid of confrontation. So if there is something that needs to be said, I don't because I'm afraid of talking to people and actually confronting someone about something. I'm terrified of talking to people and I'm also extremely terrified of getting in trouble. I bottle things up a whole lot. I just don't talk to people about what's bothering me. I think all the time and overthink everything that I'm worried about um, and it just makes me miserable and it makes my friends miserable because I end up pushing myself away. I'm extremely afraid of telling people no. Um, I'm not afraid, but I don't like it. I'll be like, yeah, of course, even if I don't want to do it. And then I end up backing out on it because I don't want to do it. And I just kind of like am afraid of saying no, I guess. I tend to have like 10 or 20 different personalities. And it's, I think it's all just sub personalities in one big personality, but I feel like I'm being fake. And I don't want to feel like that because it just happens. It's just, it's just very weird. Like, I'll be able to switch instantly to some super, super happy, you know, bubbly person. And then five minutes later, I'll just be like Eeyore from Winnie the Pooh. Or, you know, switching from sad to angry or like super happy to angry. It's, it's very confusing. I have kind of just a main happy personality and then I kind of just drab uh, eh, personality. I switch between those two so often that they're just starting to get mixed up and it's very stressful because I don't know which one is the real me. It's like two different people kind of thing. I tend to come up with excuses rather than saying what I actually feel and I really really hate that I do this but it just I do it without even realizing. I tend to think negatively and really, really hate myself a lot, <laughs> like most of the time. I, I do get a lot of comments and stuff saying like, oh, you're pretty, da, da. but the thing is that I actually literally don't believe it. You know, like I can't get myself to believe it. And I'm not doing this for like attention either. I'm not saying this for attention. I literally do not like myself. And I'm trying to change that as much as I can, but it's very, very hard for me to. I'm not sure what steps I'll have to take to change that, but like, especially this year, I've hated myself beyond what any words can explain. Um, and it's very, very painful. And I still feel that way, like, it's, I'm serious though, I really, really just don't. It, that pertains to my appearance, my thought process, my personality, the way that I deal with things. I, I don't like any of those things. I'm, I'm trying to, but I can't. It's very, very hard. 